Hello guys, welcome back to Dollar Sense. Welcome back to Dollar Sense, guys. I decided to bring this update to us on Monoris airdrop. Okay, as at this moment, today is 10th August already. I just decided to bring us this update on the Monoris airdrop because after the last video I made. I continue to observe and to study the trend of events, the developments on this air drop. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please kindly subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification. Thank you. And uh, I said, let me bring this update. Let's look at these things together, guys. Um, I don't know if, it, just in case you have paid the gas fee well maybe it's good luck to you maybe it will turn out that this whole thing is a scam i wouldn't know so either way like some people will say some people say that life even life itself is risk but is this risk worth taking guys is this risk worth taking because you must analyze and check the potentials of every risk and know whether it's worth taking you don't just jump into something because it's risk and you must take risk guys so here is the announcement i want to take us through the the announcement on their platform on their uh, on the monoris telegram platform first of all then we're going to head over to the bot itself and see what is on the interface right now here is how you can withdraw your my your mind token to your bot wallet for distribution one the fee you paid now is you is using for listing and liquid liquidity and after distribution it's gonna reflect back in your wallet look at this typographical error it's using the fee you paid now is using that is unprofessional that does not show uh work that was done it actually reflects the job that was done in a hurry okay the fee is not static and it's it changes depend it changes depends on the token mind amount again that is another one it changes depend instead of depending on okay all these ones you can they can be excused on this anyway i would say it's just grammar maybe they are not english speaking people you know so well let's still go on if you can see the green check mark it means you did it you just need to wait for the distribution time on the 10th of august now wait for the distribution time on the 10th of august and uh, the fee is not static now guys one thing we need to see we need to ask ourselves is why is their fee so high they started by demanding for one dollar uh, sorry one ton as gas fee and then it increased later to 1.2 ton and then presently as at the last time i checked it was 1.3 ton on my dashboard i don't know what yours is you can leave a comment in the comment section for us to know what yours actually is you know so the fee keeps changing and then the fee is outrageous is the gas fee is so high you need at least eight usdt to be able to buy this and that is an upward of fifteen thousand naira. okay so it's the, the the token the gas fee is very high that is one thing you need to know um secondly they say you just need to wait for the distribution time on the 10th of august i actually had to wait for this time today is 10th of august to do this video but as at now, as, as as I speak to you, nothing has changed. You still have the, the, the dashboard still remains the same. Nothing has changed. So I wouldn't know if something has changed at your own end. If you have been able to get your token distributed to you, that is one thing you should let us know. Another point we must uh, take note of is that this token... Is not listed on any known exchange it's not listed on any known exchange i've checked 
the very popular exchanges that I know and I haven't seen Monoris MRX listed on any of these exchanges. Bybit, SafePal, Binance, name it. And if you have found it, please, I will be glad to know. Okay. And again, if you check this Telegram platform, Monoris Telegram uh, community, there is no there's no provision for people to actually comment and make contributions. That means the opinion of the people of the community members are muted. Their opinion is not regarded and is not allowed to be expressed. You can't express yourself on this platform. This is unlike any uh, genuine and legit airdrop. For instance, let, let's check the Bloom community on Telegram. And this is it. You can see 556 comments on this post. You can see 2176 comments on this post. You can see each of these posts have comments. People are actually allowed to comment and air their opinion. This is how it should be. But that is not the case with Monoris, guys. So now we're going to head back to the Monoris bot. One thing I've observed on my dashboard is that the coin that I actually mined, the token that I actually mined was 7 million 941 and this fraction 730 on it i don't know how this thing automatically became 17 million okay so that's additional 10 million token where did it come from it just came they just boosted it no explanation no reason nothing they just added 10 million tokens just guys i'm suspecting that this was done just to boost one's confidence and to make one to like ah wow i can't afford to lose this whole sum of money let me just make effort and pay this gas fee and then boom when you pay it you know swallowed up or something else all right so i think this is just a mind game they are playing on the people then again you can see this post say please note that any tokens that are not claimed within the distribution period will be burned this is also a mind game just to to create that that uh, uh, law of the urgent uh, it's very urgent you have to do it now you have to do it now to ensure you receive your tokens make sure to complete the the claim process promptly pretty informed about the latest updates and announcements okay now let's try to claim the token let's see what happens okay you can see the gas fee is still 1.3 and the window is still open for you to claim your token if you pay this gas fee of 1.3 ton okay now some of you might say, why am I making this video now? I'm making this video now because it's not late for you to be informed and to be free. Okay, you can see, as you can see, the window is still open for you. If you, if you choose to, to go ahead to pay this exorbitant gas fee, amount as gas fee, fine, you can do so. And if you choose to, if you decide not to, seeing these reasons that I have pointed out and more, then you can decide to do so. Whichever way you choose, whichever uh, thing you choose to do, it is risk, right? It is risk anyway. But for me, I don't think I'm ready to risk this amount, such a high amount as gas fee for this. Not, not at all. I didn't see this coming i didn't expect this and i, I know a lot of you guys did not expect this 1.3 ton 
over 15,000 naira. Eight dollars, around seven point something to eight dollars. It's not small, guys. Though they claim that the fee will be reflected to your bot wallet, to your bot wallet after distribution. You can see just a lot of error reflected is joined to, to everything as if all these things were just done in a hurry. The ball is in your court now. You decide. What do you think? Leave a comment in the comment section. What do you think? Is Monoris airdrop a scam or is it legit? Thank you. See you in the comment section.